Hey everybody, welcome back to Basic Level Gaming. Uh, today we are going to continue on with our Night Elf Druid. Uh, we're still in the Jade Forest. We are not going to end up at the Serpent's Heart yet. Uh, I know we've said that the last couple times, you'll hear me say that at the beginning here. Um, but then we get in and realize that's not where we're at at all, or where we're headed. So, um, just one of those things, you kind of end up going all over the place. But we will get there to, on Wednesday, so it is coming. <laughs> uh, but today we do a few errands um, around the monastery, basically. And we do still gain our two levels, like we've been trying to do every time. So that's always a good bonus. And ultimately, uh, let's just jump right in and get started here. Uh, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on those notifications so you get uh, notified when we do our uploads on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. And we will get in and get started here. Alright, so we're going to jump right back in here with our level 26 druid. Uh, we are still in the Jade Forest. Um, we just received er, arrived at the Serpent's Heart, and we were getting ready to... Oh no, we're at the Monastery. I thought we were going to the Serpent's Heart. Oh. We are doing a different quest line that was on the way. I apologize for that. I totally didn't realize that we went to a different spot. But that's okay. We will do these these ones. Why not, right? Oh, hello. So let's see. We've arrived at an exciting time. Isn't it always exciting? Um. Oh, we're going to take on some new trainees. Am I here to study? I mean, sure, why not? I'll learn whatever I can. I'm going to talk to the High Elder. Travel safe. We're going to have to get out of travel form, unfortunately. Well... If I remember right, maybe this is an elevator. I think I've been in here once before. No, it isn't. So how do I get upstairs? Must be some stairs around the outside, maybe? I have a hard time sometimes inside the buildings. No, there's no stairs around this side, anyway. What over here? No? Alright, I feel like I'm being punked here. Oh, I just didn't go all the way around far enough. I see the stairs. Helps if you open your eyes. Here he is. What wisdom do you seek? Um, so he wants to teach us some idea of how it is to how it feels to be a Pandaren. Let's see, can I jump? I can jump. A little bit of damage. No big deal. So there's going to be a banquet. Hey, I'm all up for eating. Oh, but I need a gift. Oranges. Alright, I can get oranges. I know we had another quest here, though. So let me figure that one out. I thought it did anyway. Oh, maybe not. Okay. As of the orchard. Serpent's heart. The veiled stare. Uh, 
All right, so let's go to the orchard. That looks like our next goal here. Those are some nice looking oranges. Is this it already? Oh. Why are you taking away my oranges? Alright, am I going to have to kill you? I think I am going to have to kill these guys, even though they're not aggressive. I don't think I'm going to get any oranges if I don't. Got an orange, so now I know how to get oranges. But I like to kill stuff. Two more. I need to get this. Got them all. Oh, that's way down there. I just saw Orchard, thought it was the same place. Okay. Well, let's head back up here then. That was easy. I kind of like the little Pendar and they're cute. Greetings. Perfect. Oh, she's bringing beer. Okay. Now we are looking to go to the banquet grounds. I hope to see you again soon. Looks like that is over here somewhere. Oh, we got all kinds of Pandar in here. Oh, they all look drunk. Well, not all of them, but a bunch of them. You have the eyes of one who has traveled much. May the red crepe live forever. Fighting. <laughs> All right, let's hit the teacher. That's always a good thing, right? and drink with me. I'm going to do that. Well, I'm not going to drink, but yeah.
Oh, he's down on the ground. Okay. to talk to oh, you. You are most welcome. Family, friends, oh. Ooh, these are what matter most. Apparently I'm drunk. Welcome. Two. Oh, there's another one out here, though. Let's see. Oh, the Slow other train. Enough of that. Greeting, Wanderer. Next one is on me. Hello. That almost felt like he was using abilities on him. <laughs> Cause I wasn't I don't think I have anything that knocks him down and stuns him like that. But I don't know. Oh, I bet it's their Whatever that ability is, it's popping something up there. It goes away before I can do anything. Tell me of your troubles. Let's heal real quick. There is no hurry. Hello. Jade Oh yeah, it's from being drunk. It says stumble, too much to drink. Hello. Next one is on me. It seems mean to be beating up on these little Pandaren guys, but that's what he told me to do. I got two more to go. Hello. May the mist protect you. are done.
ZZ the Dexterous. Alright. He fights with blinding speed and less than blinding intel intellect. <laughs> And then and then Hushan, maybe? And he's gonna be by the water. No way. Until next time. Let's see, it looks like one of them's right out there somewhere. But I'm gonna go... No, let's go ahead and get these out of the way. See right outside this way? Yeah, maybe. Why am I going slow? Speed up. Nope, not here. Ah, there he is. Put my back to the mountain in case he knocks me up in the air. I don't have a target. What's Duken? I don't think my... There we go. I don't know what was going on there. Alright, that one's done. Let's just go ahead and get the other one out of the way first, and then we'll come back and turn them in. Do you hear the river's song? Those are both done. Mm -hmm. um, we may have already met the best student. some gear this I time. I will say, I feel like, and maybe it's just because you're not getting as many levels, um, but I feel like I'm not getting new gear all that often. Um, it just seems like most of the time I'm wearing the same gear. Occasionally in a quest line I'll get something I want to put on, but for the most part there just isn't anything that I'm gonna wear. I need to go find a vendor here too. Got a lot of junk. Of your troubles. Better go to Capcom first. Jade Serpent. <laughs>
Sorry, I didn't mean to hit you after you were done. His size training. <laughs> I didn't see that at first. It says, you in this time. I better get back to my size training. What do you need? Let's see. So this gives me plus one of everything. And this trades three haste for three mastery. I think I'm going to go with this one, which gives me plus one critical strike and plus one haste instead of switching over. Because basically I'm giving up four haste for the three mastery because I'm going to lose the plus one that I'm getting here too. So we're going to go with this one. So, oh, the other instructor. Let's go ahead and go over here to the grounds though. And do Grandmaster Wu first. Groundskeeper Wu. There we go. Well, so it's off that way, so we can go out here. There we go. Up there. Sometimes I get a little mixed up with the elevation. Like, it'll say something's right in front of me, and I'm like, well, where is it? Mm -hmm. And it's just up above. So you have to make sure you're looking at the level of where you're at, too. Oh, we got a level. 27. Oh, we got a oh, PvP talent. Okay. I do need to go ahead and do that, otherwise it won't go away. Oh, I got feline swiftness. I need to look at what that is, too. Um, let's see. So I need to obtain switches from the area around the market. I need to buy a black walnut extract. And buy three triple bittered ales. All right, I can do that. I go watch over you. Let's look at this talent because I hate those little anno announcements. Oh, well, I guess maybe it just means there's another. Oh, yeah, there's another option. Okay, that's okay. That should go away then without me doing anything. And then let's look at this feline swiftness. Somewhere. It must be in the feral section. There it is. It's passive. Oh! Nice! I just get a 15% movement increase. I'll take it. So I'm guessing one of the vendors I need is right here. I don't see anybody. Oh, here we go. Greetings, wanderer. And I get to sell a bunch of stuff here. It's kind of nice, and I still look through everything because, well, I don't know, just habit, I guess. Um, but it's kind of nice that now the things that have absolutely no use... Um, other than selling them, you'll notice there's a little gold coin on the picture, on the icon. Um, so you don't have to necessarily look through everything. You can just know that those are things you want to get rid of. So, So we are cleaned up a bit here. So I need these. I need three of them. And if you, you'll see this little window came up here. If you hold down shift and you click on something, 
it brings up that little window and you can say how many you want. So I want three of them. So I got them. May the mist this just makes it a little bit faster than having to click it three times. Not a ton, but Tell me of your if you need a whole bunch, then it does. I hope to see you again soon. All right, so now I need switches, which I, I believe are just little branches that it says should be all over the place, according to the picture. And I guess I haven't really talked about that. Up here on the map, you'll see that there's this outline that I'm in. And if you mouse over it, you'll see that it says, I need six rattan switches. So it just kind of gives you an idea of the general area. Now, I will say um, on some of the quests that we've done so far, I have noticed that it isn't always 100% accurate. Sometimes it'll make it look like... Um, there's you're outside of the area and there's actually something there so um just something to keep in mind it may be a little bit off but it gives you at least a general idea and now i know what i'm looking for i'm looking for these little tree things there's some Got four. We just need to find two more. Oh, here's one. Actually, it looks like there's two. Yep. All right. That was easier than I expected. So far, a lot of the quests have been generally pretty easy. Like, I don't feel like what do you need? we've had to... The only one that's been a little more complicated is that spirit one that we did uh, last episode. It was just a lot more to it, it seemed like. So, we need to get a boiling cauldron from in the Waxwood Forest. We need blush leaf extract, which is also in the Waxwood Forest. We need 80 vials. Wow, hopefully you get quite a few from each one. And this one, we need to kill Greenwood Sprites, which is also in the Waxwood Forest. Goodbye. I guess we will be going to the Waxwood Enough Forest. What's... Oh. Just saying this is where I'm going to bring it back to, I guess. What is right over there? I'm going to go to him real quick. Just in case he sends me to the waxwood for us too. Come speak with me. Oh, no, that's gonna be a fight. I'm gonna leave that one until later. I'm gonna go do this forest stuff first. Speak up. Some waxwood tigers, so we'll kill some of them too. Okay, that's the one I already looked at. So let's go kill some stuff. Yeah, trickster. That's right. And these guys dropping straight silver made me think of something else. So if you look um, down here in the area here, you'll see how much money we have. It's worth noting that this is something else that seems to have changed, at least since I left. It used to be a lot harder to get money. Like, you would be hurting for gold. This much gold, this early on, would be a lot of gold back then. 
So I don't know if that's something that came from the Shadowlands pre-patch, um, or if it is an older change than that, but it's just something to note. And, uh... I guess I don't get credit for those two that got added on. I'm just waiting for... Let's go ahead and heal here. So anyways, as far as the gold, if that's something that... Um, you know, you happen to be watching this video and you kind of know when that all went down, um, it'd be great. Leave a comment down below, let me know. Because um, I am curious. Like I said, it used to be something you would constantly be struggling with that you would need more gold. So, it's just kind of neat to not have to have that worry, at least so far. Obviously, later on, things get way more expensive, but... Some of it is also probably a little bit to do with you're not spending gold to train anymore. So, you used to have to constantly train your uh, skills, like whenever you would level up or whatever, and now you just get them for free. And I've mentioned that before when we first started, but it's something that I'm sure has an impact on the fact that you have more gold because you don't have to spend that. One down. I'm gonna get the last. I need. I still need five more tricksters. So I'm gonna get them out of the way too here. Oh. I'm no longer newcomer chat. We never used it anyway, but um, we've graduated to general chat. Whoa. Hey, hi, guy. I feel like he's an ant man. Oh, hey, we got some gear. And they are leather. You know, that's something else. I have not picked up any gear, I don't think, that I can't wear. So, like, I'm not getting cloth gear or um, plate. I guess I can wear cloth, but it's not something you would wear. So, But it's just interesting because... Everything I've picked up, I'm pretty sure, has been leather. So I don't know if that's also another change, or... Because it used to be you just never knew if you were going to even be able to equip what you picked up. <laughs> that sounded like he said watermelon. Oh, hey, I need some of those. I forgot all about them. I got three out of it. Man. 80 is a lot. When you only get three. Hopefully you get more sometimes. Nope, you get two. Well, technically four, I guess. Uh-oh. I'm all right. I thought maybe I was going to have to panic there, but it worked out. Any more of these guys spawn up? I like to finish one area so I don't forget to go back and check it. Oh, we got an undead guy. 
I think he must be on the same schedule I am. That looks like the same warlock that's been... That terrorized me all through the... Spirits area. I'd like to finish this quest up, but... There's some more. And we got rid of him before he summoned his buddies. Not this time. Thought I saw another one up there. There we go, there's one. How many more do I need? This will be the last one, that'll work. Alright, so done with those. And the best part about being done with those particularly too is that they are Um, I'll come back for the cauldron because I think I have to take it back. So it'd be good to finish the other ones first. Um, but they're not aggro, so when I come back through here to get like the cauldron, I'm not gonna have to worry about being attacked by the tricksters. So because they were neutral. Here's a target. I'm out of range. Oh, hey, I got three that time. I'm out of range. I might get that mama. I was trying to avoid it, but... I do like that little heal. I need to remember to use it more because it does refresh um, rather quickly. I mean, it's um, you get it for one and a half, you know, you have to wait one and a half minutes, but that's not that long, you know, so. Wow, that time I got four groups. I'll take it. I wonder what that means. My hands are dyed red. No, okay. So they're red. I have red paws. I don't think I mind. Here's a Those 80 didn't take as long as I thought they were going to. Oh, I'm actually already done with these guys, too. So, let's get out of here. Maybe my next test will help me get rid of the red on my hands. <laughs> In case I truly cared about that. Oh, let's go. Yeah, whatever. I'm just going to run through you. I'm not afraid of you. Sometimes you can do that. I mean, some areas you don't want to, and if they stun you, it can cause a problem. Um, but overall, I mean, so what? Oh, 
I don't think I care about this. Okay. I'm not being attacked or nothing, so... I'm not sure why this is a challenge, but... I guess it's just symbolic, maybe? Turn you in Slow first. Down. White Tiger, watch over you. You too, man. Now, how did I not find that before? I walked right through here. I need to go up there, right? Yeah, I think so. No. Over here. Here we go. Yeah, this is the right way. Dragging this cauldron behind me is making me confused. Whoops! <laughs> so confused I jump off the bridge. Let's see, up stop. Come on, cauldron. Mm -hmm. Oh, these are big upgrades. Okay, that's kind of funny. I was just talking about needing better gear. So we got four agility, armor, and stamina, or seven stamina. So those are the same. So it's either haste and mastery or critical strike and mastery. I'm going to go with Critical Strike this time. Try to stay a little well-rounded, especially early on, um, where I'm doing most of everything by myself. Later on, when I'm fighting in, like, raids and things like that, I can specialize more because somebody else is taking care of, like, taking the damage or whatever. Um, but early on, I try to stay relatively well-rounded. Enough of that. What do you need? Oh, I thought I had Until another one to give him. Time. I guess not. Alright, I am going to go down here though. Where was that other one I was just doing? Because we're just about out of time for today, so let's... I kind of want to do the one... Is this it? Yeah. I think that's the one I was just looking at. No? I thought I had one where I had to fight... Well, if I did, it went away. I don't know. Maybe that is it. We'll head over there and find out. Yeah, no. This definitely isn't it. There was one I was just looking at where I had to... Slow down. Um, where I had to, like, shoot off fireworks and then sit there and fight off those who attacked. But I guess it went away. Enough of that. Okay, this is kind of annoying. 
Yeah, I can growl. A lot. Why didn't that work? I did what he said, maybe I didn't wait long enough after he did it. We're going to practice our training abilities on the training bags in the pit below. Get a new belt for this one, so it's worth it. That one not. do you need? So here we're trading three critical strike. Let's try first make sure. Okay. So here I gain three critical strike and one haste. Yeah, that's no question for me. The other one I lose three critical strike, but I gain a haste and six versatility. But I'm pretty Wait, focused. I mean, I'm not really worried about the versatility a ton, so... And there is our second level. Now we gained Maim, which is a new finishing move. It causes physical damage and stuns the target. I like that idea. Stuns are good. All right, so I'm gonna go back to... Oh, there's the quest I missed. How did I get there? No, why did I go there? I need to go here. So it's straight off ahead. No, where 
is it? It says I'm practically on it. Ah, there it is. Alright, so we're going to cut it off here. And when we come back to Wednesday, uh, we will pick up on doing this quest here. And then moving on to... Looks like we do need to head out and... Well, it looks like we finished all of the quests right here. Looks like that was the end of the line for those. So we will be heading off to the Serpent's Heart, which is where I thought we've been going for the last two episodes. So um, looks like we are finally going to make it there after we do this quest here. Um, unless this leads to more, of course, then we'll finish up here. Um, but we will see you on Wednesday. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and have a great day. And while this is logging us out, we do also need to figure out, I need to wash my hands somewhere that I missed. Probably up by where we turned it in to get rid of this, because I don't know if I care about that, but I don't like having it sit there. So we will do that next time as well. All right, so there you have it. Uh, we did make it to level 28. Felt like a little bit of an errand boy today, but we still got good experience and still were able to keep going. It does kind of feel like we're starting to get closer to some more challenging things, though. Um, you saw, like, even just when we get a hold of that matriarch and we were fighting two of the tigers at once, it started to get close. So hopefully we'll start to get where it's a little more challenging. You have to be a little more strategic, that kind of a thing, um, before too long here. Uh, so definitely appreciate you joining us. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Um, and we will we will be looking at the PvP soon. Uh, it is something that I'm starting to get a little bit interested in. Um, and to see, you know, kind of where we are when we do pick that up. I also don't necessarily want to leave the time, the chromy time that we're in where we're leveling up either. So I got to kind of weigh that one way or the other. Um, does it make a difference if we leave and then come back? So I'll kind of take a look at some of that and see how that affects us as well um, before we start up on Wednesday. Um, so definitely come back and join us Wednesday for the next episode. Uh, we should hopefully hit level 30 next time, as well as finally get to the Serpent's Heart. Um, so definitely thanks for joining us, and make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on those notifications. And then also leave us a comment down below. Tell me what you think, what you like, what you don't like. Um, you know, this is all about helping all of us learn. So if there's something I need to focus on a little more or something you specifically have questions about, by all means, let me know. I'm, I'm open to any kind of information that you got. Uh, so let's, let's work on, to, on this all together. Uh, hopefully you have a great day, and we will see you on Wednesday. Bye.